I first met Mark about five years ago when I was in the market to buy a house. He took me to several auctions, helped me through the auction period. We had a look at some, we bidded on some, we missed out on a lot. He showed me probably about 30 houses, found me the house one day, rang me at work at about three o'clock, said you must look at this house at 5.30. Went down, looked at the house, walked out and um, signed a contract. Mark and I have been mates ever since. When we left the house that we didn't like, I told my husband that I loved Mark's shoes and that we should definitely use him as our real estate agent. True story. Mark is acting as my agent because of honesty and truthfulness. I've been in the Redlands for 26 years, 27 years. I have dealt with other real estate agents. Mark's candid and honestness is the reason that he's acting on my behalf. I guess integrity. Someone we can't see through. Someone that's all there and very honest. That was the number one. Mark, Mark fitted that really well. The easiest example would be to say that when we first met Mark, Billy was about yay big. Now Billy's about this big. He still visits us for our coffee. Yeah, comes in for a coffee and says good day. He's very approachable. He listens to what you're looking for. If I tell him that I want something with three bedrooms, two bathrooms, Mark went and found that for me where the other agents were showing me things where, oh, I thought you'd be interested in this or thought I'd be interested in that, but they didn't listen to what I wanted. Doesn't give me the hard sell at all. In fact, I don't think he gives anyone the hard sell because it's not his nature, it's not his character. What he does, he looks at the property, puts his own value on the property that he believes he can get for it, discusses all of that with you, comes up with an, a compromise between maybe what I want and what he believes the market will give us, but he sticks to that. He doesn't come back to you trying to knock you down and then force you into signing it because it's the best offer you're going to get. Doesn't do it. He has always been out for our best interests mm. in both buying and selling when he's batting for the both sides, I still never felt that he was trying to get more money out of us for this house because it was listed with him. He's always been on our side and he, he just did a phenomenal job. Phenomenal. <laughs> he's got an eye for the faults, he's got an eye for the good things, but he can really tell you honestly what he thinks of the property, what he thinks it's worth. If he says that property there he thinks is worth 500000 I believe him. The thing that for us made it so easy was he would just fit in and come to us at any time. Having a strategy from the word go really made a huge difference to us. So the minute the property was on the market, it was 100% ready to be sold. There were signs up, there was internet, he was here. Everybody just worked in together and we had this house sold in one week. With real estate, I refer him to other people um, who has done very, very well for, some personal friends, some relatives. I've bought houses with him, Mark sold houses for him. Um, so yeah, he's, all around he's just uh, an honest real estate agent, um, which is pretty hard to find these days. He's a hard working, good old fashioned business person that is trustworthy and we would use him time and time again. Yep. He's our real estate agent for life. And potential babysitter. And potential babysitter. <laughs>